Valentine's Day was coming to the island of Adventure Bay and everybody was excited. There were to be lots of picnics on the island, a magnificent orchestra or brass band, and a giant fun fair. And everybody was excited. Valentine's Day was a celebration about love. Chase and Marshall were racing. Whoever arrived first at the wharf would be given a very special job. I'm gonna win, said Marshall. Definitely not you. You're the slowest. I'm gonna win because I am the steadiest. But I am the strongest, said Marshall. And on they raced. Faster than the blowing wind behind them and more fast than a shooting star. Chase and Marshall kept racing until they got to the wharf. The wharf was really busy. Everyone was busy. And everyone was busy. Chase and Marshall raced in. First, Marshall was in front. Then, Chase took the lead, but Marshall went after him. Sky, Rubble, and Rocky were busy doing their work. The, fin the finish line wa was about one mile away, so they steamed out, raced out. They, they raced past a big tree and under and through some more hidden traps. They were pretty dirty from a storm about a week ago. How long will it, will, it, will it be until the finish line? The sun is almost setting. Look! They were right. The sun was setting and it was getting dark. Nah, who cares? Uh, nah, who cares? And just as Chase was to say another word, Marshall raced ahead of him. Hey, get back here! At last, the finish line was about there, and Marshall whooshed in front and won. Marshall was happy. I won! I won! Huh. All went on the way back to the lookout. Hmm. Goodbye. Chase went away. Rocky was the one to greet the winner. Great job, Marshall. You had both does a good job. Chase, you must go to the lookout. You must go to the main line and clean the big mess on the line. Chase went away to go clear the line. And the special, special job goes to you, Marshall. You are to work here at the wharf for the rest of the day. Hooray! Said Marshall. That would be lovely. So, he went away. Oh, and did I forget to mention about the big ma- But Rocky didn't have to finish his sentence as Marshall raced away to go and work with Rubble and Sky. Rubble and Sky were working. They were spiffing, pulling, and also the most important job of all, clearing the mess up. Marshall came in to help. What do I need to do? Well, a boat just came in and gave us a delivery. Oh, there's the delivery then. It's straight over there. And, and up ahead, they saw a delivery full of leaves. Leaves? What are they for? Well, Ryder said that someone littered the ocean. Oh, that's not going to be good. So the bull has brought in the leaves in the ocean. 
and I need you to go and collect that and take it to the rubbish dump right away. And Marshall went away to go and collect it. He backed onto it. It was as smelly as, as the cheese he ate a month ago. <laughs> this is just the worst thing I've ever smelt. Even that cheese I had a month ago. And he went away. And Marshall was kind of cross. <laughs> smelly job, smelly job, smelly job. At last, he arrived at the dump. And the dump was filled with rusty old parts and materials. There was an old sleigh, old, old uh, fences, and lots of old other things. Marshall hated the job. He hated working on the smelters. There were some of the rustiest and dirtiest parts ever. But he especially didn't like how dirty everything was. Ooh, P.U., I hate this place. Huh, that's why I never work at the dump. Whatever this guy said is wrong. And he was so angry about working at the dump that he gave his delivery a giant shunt. The delivery flew into a pile of rubbish. It crashed and bashed into the rubbish. Huh, I don't need that anymore, he said, and he raced away. Sky, he raced over to Sky. Sky, do I have any more work to do here at the wharf? I'm getting tired with all this smell of garbage. Unfortunately, no more work for today. The sun has already set. And unfortunately, we won't be able to work until tomorrow. Marshall was angry. Oh, and did I forget to mention, who's your Valentine? Sky thought, then answered, you. You? You are my Valentine? Why didn't you say? I didn't want to keep you. I, I didn't want to. Um, I didn't want to uh, get you out of your job. Yeah, I didn't. I, I saw you. I saw that recently you were very busy. So I didn't want to bother you. Oh, well, glad that you told me once in a while. Hey, what? Hey, I got an idea. What? Would you like to go to Don Vito tomorrow night? Uh, okay. I love that. And we can each have a pizza each. Maybe something else, or we'll see. And so, they went away. To go back to the lookout. <laughs> Chase and Rocky had finished their work and were now out of feet. Hmm. Is there any more waste? Is there any more mess on the on the on the tracks? Unfortunately, there still is. But while you're at it, can you take that rubbish car over there? There is it. It's over there. Come on, Marshall took a rubbish car. I am taking a rubbish car. And it seems as you're gonna take another rubbish car. Well, I am gonna take another rubbish car. But tomorrow, because the sun is already set. Okay, well, I'll go and collect that. So he went away to collect it. He went away. Once again, the smelters had rusty old parts and machines. All the same, he didn't like working at the, at the rubbish waste, the rubbish dump. I hate this job, I hate this job. I pushed him, pushed his car hard. Just
just as Marshall gets crawled into a pile of rubbish, it crashed and bashed off the line. That'll show the car. That'll show the car. Then we went away back to the lookout. The next night, Sky and Marshall went to Don Vito for dinner. Sky and Marshall arrived at Don Vito. Uh, hello, you two. What can I get for you today? What can I get for you today? Uh, hello. Would, can we have, can I have a seat for me and my girlfriend? It's Dragobeta, you know, and I found a Dragobeta. Uh, okay. That's really cool. That's cool. So, we just set up tonight a special seat for someone, and you two will be that someone. Follow me. And they and they went on to and they took Sky and Marshall to the corner of the restaurant. There was a very special seat which was close to the which was close to the window. Here you go. This is your special seat. Wow. Wow, we get to have this modern, cool, big, awesome. Yep, this is just for you. Thank you. Thank you very much. And, and Marshall and Sky sit down. Bye. See ya. And Rubble and Rocky race away. Wow. Wasn't it a good idea to go on this date? Sure is. Sure is. This sure is a good date. So, um, what are we going to be doing after we get dinner? Well, I don't know. Maybe we'll go to, like, the park or something to exercise us. Um, okay. Seems good. Seems good. Just look at this restaurant. There are a lot of apples. And look, there's the best part of all. The kitchen. Ton, ton, ton. Indeed. We love the kitchen. Hey, Marshall. Have you ever been in the kitchen at Dom Vito before? No. Me neither. Hey, we'd like to see the kitchen one. But we can now because we're on a date. And plus, they might not allow us because of, well, coronavirus. <laughs> anyway, so um, what do you expect for tonight? Hmm, no idea. Hmm, maybe... Oh, look, look over there. What is it? Look out the window. Oh, yes, the window. It's just beautiful. The window is just beautiful. Mm hmm It looks like they perfectly polished it. Mm hmm They certainly did. Ooh, look at that painting up there. Oh, yes. That big painting is beautiful. Uh, yeah. So it's a really beautiful day today, isn't it? Yep. It's Drago Bete. That means it's, it's time to have a date. And we're already here. Then Rubble and Rocky arrived. Can we get you two anything to eat? Of course. Marshall, what would you like? I would like a cheese pizza. And Sky, what would you like? I would like a cheese pizza too. Hey, hey, actually, we could share a cheese pizza. Wouldn't that be a good idea? Yep. So the, so the answer to that question is, we will, we, we will share a cheese pizza together, okay? 
Seems fair enough. We'll go to the kitchen and we'll see what we have. So they did. Chase is the cook of this restaurant. So, so who is the, who planned the next order? Well, it's Sky and Marshall. They're at the special seat, and it seems like they're going on a date. Date? Awesome! So, what can we get from them? Well, they asked for a cheese pizza to share. That's kind. A, a cheese and mozzarella pizza to share. Okay, I'll get straight on to this. Crust ready. Wow. Seems perfecto. Now, where's the sauce? There it is. I'll put that. Now, I need to take this pizza to a machine that pours the cheese in. All right, all right, so now it's time to put it in the oven. All right, now that that's settled, I'll just wait for the next customer. Oh, oh, I forgot to tell, to ask them what to drink. Don't worry, I'll go right away. So he raced away. Marshall and Sky were talking about the day when Rocky arrived. Uh, sorry to bother you two, but I I apologize, but I forgot to tell you what would you two like to drink. Well, I think we would like each a fruits a a fruit smoothie. Okay, right away. What flavor should they be? It doesn't matter. All right. So they went back to the kitchen. So what did they say about the drinks? It says fruit smoothie with any fruit you, we recommend. Oh, okay. I'll go and get the smoothies ready. All right. So, let's see how the pizza's doing. So, they went away to go and find it. The pizza. And the pizza was just about baking. All right. I got an idea. Do you remember that concert we planned to play tonight? I don't think it was a concert. I think it was just a guy singing a song for this restaurant. Indeed, that. Well, why don't we tell them the good news? Okay. The rubble went away too. Tell them. Marshall, Sky, I've just got the best news ever. What is it? A new singer will be coming um, to our restaurant tonight. Ooh. Who is it? You'll see. You'll see. You'll see. So, yeah, we'll see. And you guys will be amazed by what singer I've got. So, Rubble raced away. Hmm, is the pizza ready? I think so. Ding, 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 ding. Pizza's ready. All right. Sounds like we got a big one. Here's your pizza chair. Oh, thanks. Hey, also, have you guys got any ketchup if one of us wants? Sure, I'll get straight into that. So he went away to go and find the ketchup bottle. All right, here's the ketchup bottle. Thanks. Um, I'll have this slice. Um, and I'll just have this one. We can each eat half. Agree? Yes, agree. So they did. They they dug into it like dogs. Yum 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 yum
But then they noticed a uh, boo 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 boo. Who's that? Oh, I think our singer's coming up. Ooh, can't wait. Oh, and also, here's our smoothie. Hmm, it's still getting ready. So yeah, it's still getting ready. But it sounds like the singer is coming. Ooh, this is gonna be awesome, isn't it, Marshall? Mm-hmm. And they are, and there was the stage. And there was a stage. And on the stage came Baby! <laughs> what a funny name! Baby the Singer! <laughs> it's so funny, I might explode! Bad joke. Okay. I'll admit. Hey, let's pour ketchup on our pizza. Okay. Hum, yum, 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 yum. And, 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 and as always, they dug into it like dogs. Um, yum, 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 yum. <laughs> anyway. So, the singer Baby is about to sing a song. And three, two, one. Wow, that was awesome singing, wasn't it? Yeah. We should come. Hey, would you like to finish the pizza? Okay. Um, nom, 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 nom. Soon they ate it up. Oh, and Sky, let me give you this present. What? My first rig ever? This is the most... This is the... Sky, don't be silly. Yeah, but just that kid, I'll thank you enough. Yay! Thanks. Thank you very much. I cannot thank you enough for this thing. Oh, thank you. So, uh, yeah. Hey. Hey. Um. When, when is our drinks ready? I think that our drinks have been taken more than they're supposed to be. And you said it. Oh, here, here we go, guys. You asked for them, you got them. So here is your smoothie. And here is your smoothie. Ooh, neat. Let's drink them. Yeah, shouldn't we? That was a good smoothie. Hey, Marshall, your time to drink yours. Okay. Gulp, 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 gulp. Uh, apologize. Apology accepted. Wow, this is a good epi- Wow, this is a good day. Best Valentine's Day ever.